Hi you guys and welcome to my new video. If there is one thing for sure, Bali is well known for its famous rice terraces. And everybody knows those beautiful pictures of the green terraces like the Tegalalang rice fields. So today I woke up very early to discover a unknown rice field called the Sesadan rice field. Well guys, it is so early, I definitely have to start with a nice warm cup of coffee. So I am going to the kitchen, it's downstairs here. It's a shared kitchen where you can make your own food, do your own, whatever you want. So it's very, very nice here and yeah, let's just start with a nice warm cup of coffee. When people come to Bali, they love to see the well-known rice fields. There are a few around here and the most famous one is the Tegalalang rice fields near Ubud. Another rice field and also very well known is the Jatilui rice fields. But these fields are attracting so much visitors that locals decided to ask like 200,000 just for only entering the fields. Before we dive into the rice field, I wanted to tell you a very nice thing and that is using my wise card. If there is one thing I always carry with me while traveling, that is my wise card. This wise card gives you all the benefits of traveling around the world with a prepaid credit card with a Visa logo on it. The total benefit is that by transferring euros to another currency, that is what it makes it very easy to use because I don't pay any fees when I go to the ATM. If you wanted to have your own wise card, just go to the affiliate link in my description and get yourself a card. And now let's get back to my journey. So it's still pretty dark right here, but people are starting the day so early, so enjoyable. So I expect the other rice field to be a little bit more better, nicer than this. Oh my gosh, there is one thing you definitely should do when you go to Indonesia and it's just try these local things. There is nasi ayam as well. Uh, there is sambal ijo. But there are so many I know from back home. Um, but I definitely have to buy myself some food because I got no breakfast and I'm on my way. So I think I'm gonna go for the nasi ayam as well. So I bought myself for 70,000 a very nice package with lots of food so I think I'm gonna enjoy this one. I put it here in my scooter and I'm gonna drive all the way to the rice fields right now which is the other direction. And when you think you can drive straight ahead to the rice fields you just must not forget to put some gasoline in the bike. So I have to refill my tank, tank uh, with gasoline, so I have to stop very short and then I drive all the way down to the rice field. Holy shit! This is so awesome. Um, definitely enjoy this one. So I'm driving around and I love this stunning view being early being yeah, very active but hey this is so lovely and beautiful this is something you can't find when you stay in Changu so I definitely recommend that you go out early take the scooter and find yourself a nice spot I just came from there and it's very slippery there is so much moist and water everywhere oh my gosh 
After a while I finally reached the place and I was literally blown away of this marvelous view. But this was not even the best place normally, so I drove on following a very dangerous path. So I have to drive all the way through those rice fields and these roads are very slippery and you can't even turn quite normal. I have to be very careful to get from one to the other spot but I am enjoying this so freaking much because it's so beautiful to be here. There are some mosquitoes. So after a while I decided to go back to this rice field because this is for me the most beautiful one here in this area. And unfortunately I just brought two batteries for my drone which was apparently not enough so I could only drone here for like 10 seconds and then my battery died. So yep it's a shame. I have. Um, I just had to start just like here with my drone because I think it was better because this one, this part is very nice green and there are hardly any people except for the people who are working down there and this place is so nice. This place is absolutely gorgeous. It's so fascinating to be here. I'm the only tourist right here, I thought, but I was talking to a guy from Germany who is married with a Indonesian woman. And he is staying there in a homestay, which is very cheap. Can you imagine having this view every day? I am just enjoying this so freaking much. This is so epic, standing in the middle of a rice field, wearing white shoes. This is an opportunity I just had and I don't care about my shoes because I'm a very happy person right now. So let's just move on and hopefully I don't slip out here in the mud because it's very muddy and oh, I have to be careful because I don't want to destroy the rice and I don't want to get wet as well my all my gears here my camera equipment in my bag which is also pretty heavy to wear and I have to take one hurdle to get to the other side to my scooter I made it. So, ladies and gentlemen, we're at the end of this video and hopefully you all enjoy this very much. Watching me in this beautiful rice field. So, people, when you enjoy this video, please give me a like, subscribe to my channel. And if you wanted to know anything about me or this area, please leave something in the comments. See you next time.